guys welcome to my channel if you guys are new my name is Jadine and if you guys are not new then of course you know who I am so welcome back um this week I put on my everyday wig because obviously it is my everyday wig and I absolutely love it it was a very easy installation and it was of course the first time that I actually put the freezing spray on there and actually blow dried it before that I'd put the freezing spray on and tie it down and it took me five seconds to like blow dry it if that much and I love how it feels like it feels really really secured today I don't really have like a huge deal of stuff planned but I definitely want to wash the wig that I wore last week wow my stomach is out here rumbling and everything obviously I haven't had anything all morning it's 11 29 right now and this morning I woke up at 7 o'clock thinking that I was gonna go on a little run so yesterday, let me put y'all down and sit down. Yesterday, I was sitting down looking out the window and everybody was on a walk. Well, not literally everybody, but you know, a lot of people were out walking and the weather just looked so nice. And so I checked and when I did check, it was 60 degrees. But at the time when I checked, it was like 7 o'clock. So I'm like, all right, I think I'm going to go on a walk tomorrow. I'm going to start doing that. So I set, I changed my alarm from 10 a.m. to 7 a.m. and decided that, you know, um, every morning I'm going to go on these little walks, you know, just to get myself together and so I can feel so much better about myself that I'm keeping active because I feel like it's just the hardest thing to get up inside here and really actually work out. This morning the alarm went off and I didn't get up because I was tired because I went to bed at one o'clock and then when I did get up just now it's super cold outside like I was expecting today to be nice and see that is what you get living in New York like we take what we can get but when you get up one day and the weather is nice you have to make unless it's summer when you get up one day and the weather is nice you really have to make use of it because before you know it don't plan that the next day you're gonna do something because the next day is gonna be cold as hell and today's cold Hopefully later on it warms up a little bit and if it does then I'm definitely gonna take advantage of that. I also really want to get a foot scrubber because I feel like I really need a pedicure. And obviously none of those places are open where you can like go and sit and whatever to get one. So I'm gonna have to do it myself. I also need to clean off my toes today and like repolish them because the polish that is on them right now... Um, has started stripping off so I need to um, clean it off and really polish them again but today I'm really gonna see if I can find like a foot scrubber on CVS or one of them I found one on Amazon I don't know why I haven't purchased it yet though maybe I should just purchase the one that I had found on Amazon so it could get here because if I did from then it would have been closer to getting here by now because honestly I feel like I can't I just cannot be operating like this. This is so unhealthy and so unlike me. So I definitely need to get that. I'm trying to see what I want to do about my desk back there. That is, it's so, let me show you guys. It's so messy. Literally so messy. <laughs> so I want to figure out like a solution for the desk because I've known for a while that it needs to go. I just didn't know what. I was gonna do to it but now I feel like I definitely need to get a different setup for um for that area you know just so it looks more clean and more together right now it looks so untidy and I really am not living for that I need to like um oh this little candle it smells so good frankincense wow I'm gonna burn this one today this one too I want to burn it too so it could be done because I'm going to use this jar to put like some of my makeup brushes inside. Isn't this so cute? This is such a cute jar. I'm pretty sure I'd be paying like $10 for a jar like this if I were to go to Marshalls which I could just use this when I'm done burning it down and everything. But I really love how these smell. I just feel like these ones I wasn't really able to smell them like that. So this one... I'm going to light it inside of the kitchen so it could burn because lately I've been lighting a candle every single day inside of the kitchen because I really just love the, I don't know, I just love candles. 
let's say that. So I'm going to light this one instead of the, um, instead of the kitchen. This one is Pumpkin Harvest from the brand Sand and Fog. And this one is Frankincense from the brand Heaven, is it Heaven Street? Heaven SC. I'm going to light this one instead of here and just, you know, allow that to burn in and around here. I think this is what I don't like about the one wick candles. The candle itself burns and it's down here and then this is left all the way up here in the top of the thing. So I'm going to try to figure out a way to fix that today. But the, the three wick one, it burns so proportionate. Wow. Love that. So I'm going to light these. I'm going to wash the wig and then I'm going to come back later on. So guys, <laughs> it's a little bit later. But lately, I've been doing something, and I'm not sure if it's a good thing or a bad thing. My candle is burning, so I'm trying to make sure it's not going to light my wig on fire, because we're not doing all that, even though it's not that long. A week ago, I bought some candles on from Bath & Body Works, but I bought them on Klarna. And I've used this before, a long time ago, when I was buying something, but I didn't want all my money to go at once. Like, give me a couple of weeks to get it together to pay y'all. I like that. And normally, I'm not the person who likes to offer things. Like, anything that I want to buy, I want to buy it once and just be done with it. But I feel like that's bigger purchases. And that is what this whole thing has taught me. Like, little things like this. No, it's okay. You could take the money four times. It's fine. So, I bought the candles and I ended up paying $17.42 at the time. I had some things in my cart on Amazon that I wanted to buy. And like I showed you guys this space just now. I'm going to show you guys what I ended up buying to put in this space because I feel like it's going to make it look organized and then on the top of there I could put the two containers with my makeup brushes and it's going to look cute. I ended up buying this to put in this space because I like this and I have the other ones with with just um three, with just the three drawers and I really, really love it. It's very functional, it's very cute and you know it's a space saver, it's not an eyesore. Damn, somebody's calling me, I'm coming back. I decided to use the time to polish my toenails, rub them off and polish them. Now they're yellow. I'm going to show you guys them in a minute, but I wanted to show you guys the thing that I bought that I was trying to talk about before I got the call. So this is it. Yeah, I feel like it's very sleek. It's very functional. It has good storage where, um, you know, I could put a lot of things away and... This is them pretty much just giving you an idea of how they like, um, how they style it or whatever. I could put all those things away on there and not have to see them, which I feel like is pretty good because right now on top of there, it just looks so cluttered and that's not exactly what I'm going for. So, um, I'm very excited for it to get here. It's probably not going to get here anytime soon. They said they would email me with like a delivery date after I purchased it and whatever and so now I'm just waiting to hear what they say but what is so funny is to this particular thing I checked Home Depot I checked Wayfair and I checked Target and Amazon had it for the cheapest and that's what I like to do with a lot of stuff like when I when I'm shopping for something I will shop around to get the best deal and most times it always ends up being Amazon that gives you the best deal because um, it's either a case where it's like a little bit more somewhere else and it's cheaper on Amazon plus you'd have to still pay shipping for it, the other place that you'd buy it unless like you qualify for free shipping with the amount of money you spent or whatever but it was cheaper on Amazon so I went ahead and bought it there and I also bought um, some automatic spray refills a wick trimmer for my candles I bought Listerine so this is the wick trimmer, then the Listerine, and then I bought some nail form and like a, a heel scrubber or whatever. The nail form, I want to try and see if I can do my nails with just the nail form and not have to like glue anything on there or whatever. I'm pretty sure this hand is going to go smooth, but this one, we don't know. I need to figure out how I'm going to get the form on there and stuff. I don't know, but I'll figure it out once I get it and stuff like that. But yeah, I went ahead and bought that thing and I feel like it's going to just make that space look so much better and so much more organized and you know at a later date you could still always use it for something else I got it in that dark um color because my desk right now is black that blackish looking color and everything else it will go well with the rest of the living room because I have black and gold accents here and there 
and I'm really excited to get it and like style the top of it to see you know how it all comes together and stuff like that I need to get something to put over the TV right here on the wall but I don't know what that is gonna be yet I've been playing around with a lot of stuff to like see what I think would look nice there and I love that um, some of these apps have the little feature where you can view the item inside of the room so but I'm very very excited to get the the organizer for right there because right now it looks a little crazy right there it's a lot of things that I want to get rid of too and I feel like getting that will prompt me to like go in and like declutter a lot and stuff like that so I'm very 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 excited for it to get here but um yeah oh let me show you guys my toe still haven't put away the makeup brushes but I think I'm gonna wait until so my toes are currently yellow I'm gonna put some top coat on them right now and then that be it these brushes I'm waiting until I get that same organizer to really organize them and I'm hoping that the candle that I just put on the table burns down by then so I can empty out the container to put some of my brushes in because it's black and it's like cute and I absolutely love that or I have another container on the table that I could use too so I have options which I love. Just now you guys watched me um, take some rice out of my rice cooker and put it in a container and put it in the fridge. And what that was was that yet last night when I was cooking, I just decided to make five cups of rice in my rice cooker and just put it down. That way, you know, we have rice for a couple of days so I don't have to get up every day and cook rice today. I could just make some meat and that's perfectly fine because there's rice in the fridge. And y'all just saw me struggle to put my bottle of Pinot Grigio inside of this wine rack and it's not working like no nah, i feel like it's gonna get stuck in there and i don't necessarily want that because pinot grigio is my favorite wine and the last thing i want is to have the one bottle of pinot grigio that i have stuck inside of there and i can't even drink it so we're gonna just leave it alone so i have the candle going inside of here and see it's almost ready to be taken out. I'm super excited. So I'm going to just keep burning it. I'm going to put it out and let the wax harden. And then I'm going to light it again a little bit later on. And, you know, allow it to keep going down, down, and down, and down. The other one is a freaking labor of love because it's burning. It is just a mess the way how it burns. I will never buy a single wick candle again. Like, mm -mm. after the experience I've had, no. So um, that's what I have going on right now. Closer to friends.